It's Friday the 19th of July 2024 and Zur is back in Destiny 2 for the weekend. Let's check out and see what he's got. First of all, we have the Sunshot Catalyst. That one is very, very good if you haven't got it. Already got that one myself. Also got the Traveler's Chosen Catalyst. The Traveler's Chosen is a long forgotten exotic. Very, very good though. So if you are a new player and you haven't got Traveler's Chosen, definitely look it up. I do recommend it. Next up, we got the Gemini Jester for the Hunters. That is a 66 roll. For the Titans, we've got the Doom Marchers, also a 66 roll. And for the Warlocks, we've got the Astro Sight Verse. That is a 64 roll. Not bad stat distribution on that one. We've got Nightfall Ciphers as well, so that is very, very interesting. That's new. I don't think I've seen that before. Have a look at the other items that Zer has. So, first of all, Hawkmoon. And the random roll this week is Moving Target, so that is pretty nice. We've got Arbalist as well, so this one is very, very good. If you don't have Arbalist, if you're a new player, just come in from the final shape. Definitely recommend you pick up Arbalist. This one is a fantastic linear fusion rifle but it doesn't go in the heavy slot also trinity ghoul this is simply one of the best weapons in the game especially if you get that catalyst so that is absolutely fantastic always great when uh, trinity ghoul is available and we've also got the prospector that one is a grenade launcher not a huge fan of that one myself i think you're going to do much better with trinity ghoul and also arbalist as well next up let's have a look at the legendary weapons First of all, we have the Nature of the Beast with Fast Draw, Appended Mag, Subsistence, and Range Finder. A pretty good roll. Got the Annual Skate as well. Crossfire, Acorized Rounds, No Distractions, Wellspring. I'd probably give that one a miss if I were you. Got the Arsenic Bite 4B. High Tension String, Fiberglass Arrow Shaft, Quick Draw, and Archer's Tempo. Quick Draw, Archer's Tempo. That is a nice... That is a nice combination for PvP if you like going into Crucible with a bow. Far Future, Booted Barrel, Acrise Round, Slide Shot, and Demolitionist. Kind of a confused roll, that one. Not really good for anything. Hungry Edge on Honor's Edge. Balance Guard, Tireless Blade, Flash Counter. The Pass from me. And then we've got Memory Interdict, Hard Launch, Spike Grenade, Surplus, Pain Reaction. That is a very nice roll. If you're looking for a good grenade launcher in the power slot, that is very, very good. And then we've got the class-specific swords, almost as always. So Enduring Blade, Infinite Guard, Relentless Strikes, Rounded. For the armor, we've got the Gem Sim Knight set. That's a looking good, so that's good. We have 61 on the gloves. We've got 64 for the robes. We've got 64 for the hood and 66 for the boots. That is going to be about it from where is Zer, or not where is Zer, is Zer's where's now. We, we know we know where Zer is. He's here. He's always in the tower, and it's always worth a reminder as well. But that is it from Zer for today. Anyway, well, whatever you get up to in Destiny 2 this weekend, I hope you have a good time. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for even more Destiny 2 content here on Endgamer Express. You can also like the video and share the video too. That would really, really help me out here on the channel. Well, thanks again, and I'll see you soon. Well, thank you for watching that video, and today I'd like to talk about Endgame Express Backstage, the home of exclusive content for fans of Endgame Express. To join, simply join up through Patreon or the YouTube membership. You'll get early access and exclusive content, shout-outs in the videos, access to live streams, plus also access to our exclusive Endgame Express Backstage Community Discord. Well, here's some more information about the tiers. So in tier one, that is $2.99 a month, you get access to our community Discord and also early access to content. In tier two, that is $4.99 and you get shout outs in the credits of videos and also you get access to community polls and help shape the content. For tier three, that is $8.99 and you'll get access to exclusive community videos and also get access to exclusive live streams as well. Well, the core content on Endgame Express is always going to be free, but if you want to go above and beyond and support Endgame Express, then all you need to do is get access to Endgame Express backstage today through Patreon 
or YouTube membership. You know, Endgame Express is a one-man band right now, but I would love to expand into more games, podcasts, more channels, but to do that, I'm going to need your help to make this sustainable, and in return, I offer you some exclusive benefits and backstage-only content. Well, if you enjoy Endgame Express, then consider Endgame Express Backstage today. You can hit that membership button right down below, or you can find us on the Patreon links, and you'll find those links in the description. Well, thank you for listening, and thank you once again for watching, and I'll see you very soon.